everyone welcome back to the channel Andrea here um, today we're going to do a flip through of the new Colour in Heaven magazine which is Animal Wonderland special 40 new ex and exclusive whimsical, dis whimsical designs by Kanuku Igusa um, who is the artist that did I haven't got the books but it, she did uh, Rhapsody in the Forest and Menuet de Bonheur so that's this one. This is out on the, I gotta think, 19th, I wanna say, of February. Yeah, um, I received it today. Um, well, I'm filming this today, I received it, which is actually Thursday the 13th, so almost a week early. I was very excited when I came home and saw it on the mat, I can tell you. So we got that cover page and the back cover with the little fishes and the duckies. This book is so cute. Oh, so here's the first page. These are just so pretty. Somebody's already started colouring this one on the Colouring Heaven group. And I think it's done in a little Tiffany lamp with some rabbits. And we've got teacups and little piggy, little piggy lamb bunnies and birds. That's a gorgeous fox. That's nice. Is there like an Easter egg with some chickies hatching? And this one's like a poppy field and some rabbits in a field. These cute little mice on a dresser, like a Welsh dresser type thing. Birds, nice, so cute. So yeah, these are really sweet. So it sounds like if these are 40 exclusive designs, these are not actually in the two books. So if you've got the two books, it might be worth, you know, picking this up as well if you like the artist. Because if these aren't in there, definitely worth getting. I love this hourglass. I think it's beautiful. Little poppies. Little mice having dinner with the, all the food. That's a good one. Some of the breads and the foods and dove cuts. Having birds. I like this. This is beautiful. It's so whimsical, so sweet. It's like the animals look really weird, real, but they're in like an unreal situation. So you've got like mice and rabbits sitting in armchairs and things it's just stunning the detail is amazing it's just lovely that's quite a nice one so so far i'm very very pleased with my subscription to color in heaven the first two books that um, I've had and on the subscription have been fantastic and of course that was uh, the Dreamtime Fashion which was Hannah Carlson and this one which I just think is absolutely gorgeous um, little piggies in a hat it's just so sweet oh look at that donuts and cookies the pig is serving donuts and cookies to all the other animals it's so cute Oh, I love it. It's beautiful. It's sort of upside down by the look of it. But he's the right way up. How odd. It must be a puddle. It's a puddle. It's a reflection in a puddle. Oh, that's a, that is so clever. And the little animals with the uh, umbrellas. And that's the one that's on the back with the fishes. And the frogs. Oh, that's just a nice pattern. Yeah, little frogs on there. There we go again, there's another one. It is just such a lovely book. I think Colour in Heaven is just getting better and better every every with every issue. They just look they're just getting brilliant. Um they've always been really good from day one, although I haven't got any of the really early issues. Um, 
but their magazines are getting better and better the quality is getting better the artist quality is getting better and I think it's because they're getting such a good reputation the quality of the books that they're putting out that great artists are signing up to happily let um, them use their work oh look at that so some of them are quite seasonal as well so it's a very seasonal book so we've had some spring and summer time and now we're on to autumn so we've got a bit of Halloween there um that's cute and then we move on to Christmas and we've got a stock in there we turn it around oh no it's not it's a shoe so it's very still autumn looked like a stocking so I was holding it a little hedgehog's cute right let me turn the page it's almost like they're in a little little doll's house. It's so cute. They're on a bookshelf. My shelves look like that actually. I've got trees on my shelf. Not. Still quite autumnal. We've got the pumpkins and squashes. I only got this one of the cat and the squirrel and the bunnies and they were all dressed up like little dress up paper dolls that you used to get when you were kids and you could just cut them in and and dress them up as kings, queens and witches and peasants. It's, it's really cool. That's another nice one. And here's a Christmas one with the baubles. That's going to be lovely to do for Christmas. And we've got um, Christmas trees and gingerbread cottages here and the little bears. Probably polar bears. Look at them. Oh, it's so cute. And then this one. This one is adorable. The kitten watching the snow fall in I mean how adorable is that I know I'm going on and on about it and my voice is still going but I just think it's gorgeous and then you've got the little rabbits sitting in their cosy house and that's it so that is the Animal Wonderland special from Colour in Heaven um, with uh, artwork by Kanuku Igusa so absolutely stunning go out and get it it's another brilliant issue so far this year i can't fault the issues um although i I'm, I'm not getting the collections which is the other one they do which used to be quarterly but now they're doing it monthly that will be only something i pick up if i want to for instance dogs i've got the dogs 2018 one and i've not touched it so i'm not buying another one on dogs but we'll see what the next one is and you never know, I might pick that one up. So I hope you've enjoyed this flip through. Go out and get it. Um, if you're not a subscriber to A Colour in Heaven, I would recommend it. I really would. It's lovely getting the books a bit early. Although it's not guaranteed. It's not something they can guarantee. It just happens occasionally um, that Colour in Heaven sends it out from the warehouse. And the delivery, the postal service just seem to deliver them early. Um, I'm not going to complain whether I get it early or if I have to get it on time. I'm happy that I don't have to go and try and track it down uh, in the shops because sometimes they're late getting them in and I'm like, I get frustrated when I see the one I've already got in there a week after the new one's out. So for me, it just, it's a no brainer. I am loving it so far having, having this come through my door. What could be, what could be better? We get colouring supplies through the door. Why not? the great magazine coming in heaven as well so that's it for this flip through i hope you've enjoyed it i'll see you all soon in the next video bye